touching the fingers to the floor. Bend the knees deeply here if you need to. Inhale, lifting up. As you exhale, the right leg is going to go back and to begin with, just see how it is for you. Just take the knee to the floor and make a slow transition. Keep the breath flowing freely if you need to. Inhale, lift up through the sternum. Exhale, carefully take the left leg back into a downward dog position. Inhale, into plank, shoulders over hands. Exhale, knees to the floor, elbows clipped in. Breathe out all the way down to the mat. Bring the forearms forwards and inhale, lift up through your chest. Exhale, softening back to the floor, hands underneath the shoulders. Very slow, slow, slow transition, tucking the toes under through swan and back into downward dog. Breathing freely here. Any time if it doesn't feel good, don't do it. Now you can modify your dog. We're walking the dog here, which gives the legs a really good opportunity and helps to lengthen through the calf muscles, the Achilles tendon, through the hamstrings, bring the hands in a bit closer. The objective is not to get the heels to the floor in dog, but really just to work very carefully through the legs, transitioning out in whatever way works for you today. So you can curl up and bring yourself to standing and take time to set yourself up before you go again.